Hi, Wild Ventures. Welcome back to another exciting episode of Wild Venturist. Today, we're in the heart of Karamabad, Hansa, starting our journey from the bustling main bazaar. All right, let's start our hike to the Queen Victoria Monument. It's about an hour's trek from here. Let's talk about location of the monument. The Queen Victoria Monument at the top of the rock face behind Karamabad can be reached in an hour from Baltit. Take the channel path above the polo ground. Five minutes out, cross the channel and climb stone steps beside an old watchtower. At the top of the village, scramble over to a shallow cleft with some very large boulders. Go straight up to the base of the cliff before crossing over to the monument. Avoid a diagonal crossing of the face because the top altar water channel spills down it. Thought to be erected by Nazim Khan ruler of the Hanza in Burshaski language, the monument is called Malakamushakari. No talk about short history of the monument. The Queen Victoria Monument was erected to commemorate the visit of British officials to the region and to mark the friendly relations between the British authorities and the local rulers, known as the Mirror of Hansa. The monument features an inscription that highlights this relationship and acknowledges the presence and influence of the British in the region. The exact date of its erection is not precisely documented, but it is believed to have been established in the late 19th century. The monument symbolizes the British presence in Hansa and their efforts to establish a foothold in the region. It also reflects the cooperation and alliance between the local rulers and the British, which was crucial for maintaining peace and stability in the area. The monument serves as a historical record of the era and the geopolitical dynamics of the time. Cultural impact. While the monument represents a period of British colonialism, it also stands as a reminder of the historical interactions between different cultures and empires in Hansa. The inscription and the monument itself, historical artifacts that provide insight into the region's past and its significance in the broader context of Central Asian history. Finally, we reach to the top of mountain. Let's enjoy the view of whole Hansa and Nagar from the top of the mountain. 